Hi, welcome to Mad English TV. If I ask you, how tall are you? Can you tell me your height in feet and inches? Probably not, because you come from a country that uses the metric system. But there is a country called the USA, the most advanced country in the world. I'm being sarcastic. That uses the imperial system. Okay, so they use things like feet, inches, yards, miles, gallons, Fahrenheit. Okay, now I should be careful not to criticize the US too much because in Canada we also use the imperial system very often. Okay, officially Canada uses the metric system, but in everyday life, we Canadians use the imperial system for a lot of things. Okay, so Canada adopted the metric system only in the 1970s. Alright, so a lot of old people still use yards, miles, gallons, and Fahrenheit, but most young people use meters, kilometers, liters, and Celsius. Okay, but all Canadians measure height in feet and inches and their weight in pounds. That's interesting because on my driver's license right here it says my height is 177 centimeters and my weight is 75 kilograms. Okay, that's officially so on all documents we use the metric system. But if I told any Canadian I'm 177 centimeters tall, nobody would understand me, okay? That's how much we use the imperial system in everyday language, okay? We always measure weight in pounds and our height in feet and inches, okay? Another thing I want to point out is that in Canada we spell words a little bit differently, right? So look at this, meter. RE, kilometer, RE, liter, RE. So for a lot of words that end in ER in American spelling, we switch it to RE. But don't blame us, blame England. Okay, that's the British way of spelling. So Canada is sort of caught between the US and Great Britain. We sort of share a little bit of both their language. Okay, so let's talk about me. Okay, if you ask me how tall I am, I'd say I'm 5'10". I wouldn't say I'm 1.77 meters. Okay, but it's about the same. And if you ask me how much I weigh, I would say I weigh 165 pounds. Okay, so that's roughly equivalent to 75 kilograms. So, if I ask you how tall are you, what should you say? If you ask me that, I would say 5'10". So that means five feet and ten inches, okay? One apostrophe means feet and two apostrophes means inches, okay? But native English speakers would never say this. They would just say five foot ten or just five ten, okay? Not five feet ten, five foot ten, but I think the most common way is just to say 5'10". If you ask me how tall are you, I would just say I'm 5'10". Now you can find a lot of unit conversion charts online. You know, meters to feet, kilograms to pounds. Pounds is abbreviated LBS or kilometers to miles. But I just want to give you a few of the most common conversions here, okay? So one meter is equal to 3.28 feet and a meter is also equal to 1.09 yards. If you like watching American football, you'll hear the word yards a lot, okay? A centimeter is equal to 0.39 inches. A kilometer is 0.62 miles. A liter is 1.6 quarts. Now there's four quarts in a gallon. And in the US, most people buy their milk in a gallon jug. Okay, so it's about four liters. Okay, one kilogram is equal to 2.2 pounds. 
zero Celsius is 32 Fahrenheit. Now you're also going to need to know the imperial system when you do cooking or baking. Okay, so we use these measurements here in Canada and they use them for sure in the US. So any kind of recipe you look up online, you can do that right now. Just look up online recipes. I'm sure you're gonna see a lot of these words, okay? Teaspoons, tablespoons, cups, ounces, and you might even see the word pint. A pint is equal to two cups. If you go to a bar or a pub, you're probably going to order a pint of beer, okay? Especially in England, they love their pints. They go to the pub for a pint of Guinness or a pint of cider, okay? So let's just look at some simple conversation here. So let's talk about height. How tall are you? I'm 6'2". Okay, if we talk about weight, how much do you weigh? I'm 200 pounds. Distance. How far is it from New York to Toronto? It's 345 miles by air. Okay, length. How long is a marathon? It's 26.2 miles. Width. How wide is the table? It's 20 inches. Capacity. How big is your gas tank? It's 15 gallons. Okay, area. How big is your house? It's 2,300 square feet. All right, so let's do some homework. I want you to tell me how tall you are in feet and inches and how much you weigh in pounds. Okay, now weight is a very sensitive thing in our culture, okay? If you ask someone how much they weigh, that might be dangerous. You might offend them that might be very rude, okay? So you need to be very careful when you ask someone about their weight, okay? If you don't wanna tell me your real weight, just make up a number, okay? Post your answer in the comments right down there, and I'll see you over in the next episode of Mad English TV. Take care.